The Azimio Brigade stormed in Kisumu, Nyanza region. Odinga security having had time to curb Azimio supporters. Odinga making a grand entry into his home backyard Dala. At the Jomo Kenyatta Stadium, thousands of Odinga supporters flock here. Niraila! As mayor leaders urging residents to turn out in large numbers on August 9 and vote for Raila Karua ticket. Mwaka wa alfumbini na saba tulipigia Raila Kura. Mwaka wa 2013 tulipigia Raila Kura. 2017 tulipigia Raila Kura. Sasa tumefika. 2022 tupigia nani kura? Tupigia nani kura? Kwa hivyo tare tisa mwezi wa nane, muamuke asubui mapema, mpige kura mapema. Hiyo kura yenyu ndiyo itararua umaskini. Hiyo kura yenyu ndi itararua ufisadi. Hiyo kura yenyu ndi itararua shida zote ya watu wa Luanda. Na hiyo kura yenyu ndi itararua ruto. Sasa kazi ya kumaliza hiyo mabadiliko na kuleta mabadiliko ya kiuchumi. Hakuna mwingine wakati huu anaweza kutuongoza tufike mahali tunaenda. Ni Raila Amolo Odinga. Kila nini wale ambao wako wani hawezi kuenda kule wale mavu unawasaidia. Na vijana nyinyi mnarao mshikulia kuna kulala. Sasa hili wanafungwa vituo mwenyewe mko pale. Wazee wakija na kina mama na wasaidia wapike kura warudi nyumbani. Lakini nyinyi mna kesha pale. Mpaka jioni. Mpaka wanafungua debe mko pale. Wanahesabu mko pale. Mpaka watangazi ushindi, sio? Tumeleana vizuri. According to the IEBC voter register, Nyanza region counties has more than 3 million registered voters that Azimio is gaining to back. I will come here today to tell you my people that I want 100% turnout this time. Not a single vote should go uncast. Those who are sick, who are in wards in the hospital, go and get them to take them to the polling station to vote and take them back to the wards. Those who are disabled should be enabled to go and cast their votes. Those, the youth of, of, of Kenya, the youth of Nyanza, should not leave that, that, that night. No sleeping. All be awake and go to cast your votes. The way you know how to do. Okay? As the mayor presidential candidate Raila Odinga saying Kenyans will have now a chance to decide on whether they will choose a development or continuity of corruption in the country. He uchaguzi ya wikijayo ni baina ya ufisadi na ukombozi. Mwana vizuri. Ufisadi na ukipiga kura kwa azimio la umoja umepiga kura kwa ukombozi. Ukipiga kura kwa Kenya kisha umepiga kwa ufisadi. Tumeona vizuri? Umeona Kenya yote iko nyuma yake. Umeona hata mlima Kenya tuko nyuma ya Raila Amolo Odinga. Hata marafiki yetu wakaanza kupata makasiriko mbaya. Mtu anaenda na makasiriko kwa mkutano karibu wa pasuke. Ukimuuliza jina anasahau anaanza kusema uhuru alifanya. Ukimuuliza sera anasahau anasema uhuru amefanya. Azimio leaders taking a swipe at their opponents Kenya Kwanza Alliance whom they termed as unfit to hold any public office. Sera yake imebaki kutukana rais uhuru na kutukana baba. Na mimi nasema 
Heri baba awe baba wa kitandawili kuliko aitwa muizi. Tuko pamoja? Heri awe baba wa kitandawili kuliko kuitwa Tunakubaliana? Tunaelewana? Mumesimama kidete na Raila wakati mgumu mpaka wakati unaanza kuwa mzuri. Mumefurahisha wengi kwa kukataa manabii wa uongo kuwafuata watabahari wa ukweli. Mumesimama na wanaharakati kupinga wale wamepigana maisha yao yote Kenya irudi nyuma. Odinga and his running mate Martha Karua pledging to prioritize the fight against corruption if at all they will ascend to power. I do even one imejitokeza inaitwa ufisadi 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 sasa bila bila kuwa ufisadi uwezi kumaliza yale matatu ugonjwa ujinga na umaskini maana yake pesa mingi ninaingia kwa ufisadi nyinyi mnafanya kazi kila siku mnatoa ushuru kila siku lakini hiyo pesa ikienda kule mingi yake inaingia kwa mfuko ya wale wengine ofisadi wanapenya pale ngine pale na wanatoboa na rogote hiyo pesa ni sababu naona hawa jamaa anakuja hapa akibeba kwa gunia mnaweza fikiria ni vile mtu anaonewa koti imempata na hatia mara ngapi ya kwanza shamba ya muteshi akaambiwa hiyo si yako rudishia mwenyewe na umepigwa faini ya Milioni ngapi? Mzee amekufa bila kurudi kwa shamba. Na hata hatujui kama pesa alipatiwa. Kama wewe Sauli umekuwa Paul, si ungekuwa umerudisha hiyo shamba? Na kurundisha ni kufanya mazingira imuruhusu mzee kurudi kwa shamba yake. Sasa environment is hostile. Jambo la pili mkahawa yake amejenga kwa plot ya serikali na koti ikakata kesi. This is Raila Odinga's last political campaign in Nyanza region with four days left for the August general elections to be held. Davis Mberia, Ebru News.